Welcome to life as a tourist in Sri Lanka. We're going for a joyride on an elephant. It's just an average morning. After negotiating with about a half dozen or so different providers along the main drag, we were finally up on top of our very own pachyderm for an hour ride through the village and marshlands. Not surprisingly, there was an enterprising local hanging out on the path selling bags of small bananas to feed the elephants. Incredible markup on the prices, but that's what you get for being in the right place at the right time. And having the elephant take the banana out of my hand with his trunk was simply awesome. We made it through the tour with only a small bit of traffic on the route, passing three or four other groups essentially doing the same tour we were on. One of the main differences with our ride, however, is that we were not on a platform on top of the elephant. Our guide insisted that we ride directly on the animal's back to get the full experience, and there is no doubt in my mind that it was a very different sort of trip. The feel of the elephant's shoulders and back undulating under us as we lumbered through the walk was most definitely interesting. And then, all too soon, our time with the elephant ride was done. We hopped down, gave him one last hug on the trunk, and headed off for our next adventure in Sri Lanka.